Z. Hello, my loves. Today, I'm going to be sharing with you guys one of my favorite companies ever and one of my favorite wigs. This is from Wow African. So I'm just going to open up the box, show you what's inside and tell you a little bit about it. So this wig, the particular one that I'm going to be sharing with you guys is of a kinky texture. It is GFL 19 in a natural color in 18 inches all right inside the box comes a pamphlet a little brochure with um some bloggers and some information on how to take care of your hair and tips and all of that it also comes with a wig cap um, mine was brown it comes with two wig caps in the packet they also were really thoughtful and they placed an elastic band inside as well so that you can make sure that you lay your lace very well that it's nice and flush against your head once I open up the wig, I'm going to show you guys the lace that it comes with. It comes with a lot of lace in the front. It is a lace front. I didn't get a full lace wig because I don't need a full lace. Um, but it comes with adjustable straps and combs and also some lace at the nape. Um, the lace, as you can see, needs its knots bleached. So I did go ahead and bleach that off of camera. Actually, I recorded that. I recorded it, but I had so many issues editing that footage that I don't have it today on this particular video. But if you would like to see um, the process of how I bleached the knots and how it looked after I bleached the knots, I will be more than happy to put that in a separate video so that you guys can see how I did that, no problem. Um, it came out really, really good. And once I, and I did dye this hair as well. So the natural color was at first, brown um, a natural brown color um, but I wanted it to be black so I did dye this hair so that it would be the color that you see here so I did dye it that black so it would be jet black and it held up really really well it took to bleaching the knots really well and what you see me doing right there is just blow drying the hair um, it was damp not wet because I did let it air dry and then once I was done with that I used a flat iron and I only do usually I only do one pass with the hair but every once in a while I might do two um, and that's just because I really do want the thickness to stay I don't want it to be bone straight um, but good god you guys this hair is amazing, okay? The texture is amazing, it feels amazing, it lasts so long. This is my second wild African unit and I love the Italian yaki hair because it really mimics our own natural textured hair, my own anyway. So it just feels like a nice blowout. Um, if my hair was this length, this is how my blowout would be. Um, I'm gonna show you guys now here how much parting space I have in the front so that you guys can get a good idea this does go from ear to ear parting and this is how much parting space or how far it goes back and to the side so you can see there how much parting space you are dealing with on e either side and like i said the bleaching process of the knots went perfectly so when i do it right when i lay it right um, it does lay against my scalp and look very, very, very natural. You just have to take your time and actually um, style the hair. Now, I don't usually do too much of the baby hair situation when I wear this wig, but I did go in anyway and create some baby hairs just in case I decided to lay them down and put my hair up certain times or, you know, just for kicks and giggles wanted to like mess with the baby hair but as you can see I don't really have to do that if I don't want to especially since I rock it more in the natural kinky type of state um, that part there I did over pluck okay so a lot of times I try to hide, hide that and mask it with my foundation but as you can see on the sides the edges are oh my god like it blends into my hair so freaking good like i love this wig y'all i love this wig so much i think i'm gonna buy this texture more than any other texture from by african because it can be styled so many different ways the hair it it straightens really good it curls really good it holds a curl it's amazing so now you can see here with the wig on my head um yeah i know it is not laid right now i had to pull the part up a little bit and even then 
it is not really 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 um the part is not laid as best as it possibly can but i only put it on my head just to kind of you know show you guys what's up with the wig this was made for informational purposes only okay i wasn't fully fully doing the full on that i would usually do if i was going out to slay which is bad on my part because i'm just trying to show you guys how bomb this wig is but like i said i will do a separate video for you guys actually laying down baby hairs and the whole nine if you would like that so that you guys can see how versatile this hair really is because I am in love in love this is like my favorite wig I'm not even gonna lie I, I love kinky textures I love yakky texture so this wig is definitely on my favorite list I swear like legit and I did purchase this unit by myself for those of you who are concerned with whether or not I am giving you legit honest Bible review this is definitely my honest review because I'm telling you guys I I really wear this wig when I'm not wearing the other wigs and reviewing for you guys this is my a1 day one and I usually do styles like this really really natural but I will do more videos and show you guys how else I style it um, in the meantime if you like this video definitely thumbs up check out the description and I will see you guys in the next video stay royal